Daigo Dojima, Taiga Saijima, and Goro Majima, huh? <laughs> yeah, add Kiryu-san to the mix and you've got yourself a Yakuza Hall of Fame. Yeah, maybe in the sense that we're all retired. So you're going, right? To see him, I mean? Yeah, I'm leaving now. Is that a fact? Don't know if you meant this, but, uh, you don't think you're flying solo, do you? Like that, it'd help. Come on now, Kiryu-san. Someone's gotta watch your ass. Not exactly how I'd have worded it, but he's right. We're in this together. Thanks, guys. Gonna be a long trip. Let's make sure we're ready. Ho-ho! Yeah. Dante here, Kiryu. If you have time, come to Harbor Light, will you? Sure, understood. I'll be there. Hmm. Something the matter? No, I just figured maybe I ought to give you a heads up first. See, Sayama's in town. Sayama? Kaoru Sayama? The one and only. She gave me a call not too long ago. You up for it? <sighs> Yeah, thought so. But honestly, you should go. You guys went through thick and thin together, right? At least you could do is see how she's doing. Yeah, you're right. Sorry for dumping this on you. I didn't know till just now either. So, mind cutting me some slack? Actually, I appreciate it. See you later then. me back. This brings back memories.
I totally ran into you. Ah, uh, no, it's okay. Sorry. She's a go. Wait up, wait up. Come on. I was calling your name and everything, Shizuko. Oh, sorry, Miki. Hmm? That keychain. You know, I've been wondering, that little guy on your keychain, who is he? <laughs> oh, him? Ono Michio. He's Ono Michi's mascot. Didn't you know? Uh, no. Why would I? I mean... Yeah, I know you said you were from there, but seriously, like, the heck is he? <laughs> he's just a mascot, and he's my favorite. I'm not kidding. He's really special to me. <laughs> you sure have strange taste, Shizuko. You think? Someday, I'm gonna marry Michio-kun! Surgery's the only way. Uh, if I don't get that surgery, I can't marry Michio-kun. Uh, but I'm not brave enough. Huh, I'm so scared. I'll do it. It might hurt, but I'll push through. I'll do whatever it takes. I'll be brave for you. It was Shizuko. Hey, Shizuko, we're going the same way, right? Let's walk home together. Mm, sorry. The thing came up today. I'm going to some place called Pamarocho Hills. You are? That's kind of far. Are you okay walking by yourself? You only just moved here after all. It's not like you know where you're going. <sighs> I'll be fine. I looked up directions. Seriously, don't worry. See ya, Miki. Okay. It's a rough neighborhood, so just be careful. See ya! That's nostalgic. This brings back memories. You got time, right? Wanna hang out with us? There's a great little spot nearby. My treat, of course. Um, no thank you. I really have to get going. Hey, hang on a sec. 
There's no need to act like that, is there? What are you even doing over here? You looking for a sugar daddy? Uh, not at all. I, I just got lost and... Hey, come on. Like we buy that? Now, let's make some memories. What do you say? Someone help! Please! Get your hands off her. Touch Shizuko again. You're dead. <laughs> Yo, what? Who the fuck is he? Wait, you know my name? <sighs> You're out of your league. Now get lost. I won't wait around forever. This guy's a freak. Hey, are you good, man? Let's bail. We won't forget this. You old fuck! <sighs> Damn kids. Um, thank you so much. Hmm? Oh, no, no. Uh, don't mention it. Take care. Um, sir? I wanted to ask. Hear you, son? Right? It's you, isn't it? <clears throat> <laughs> it is you! I knew it! The same Kiryu who introduced me to Michio-kun. <laughs> oh, wow! To think we'd meet in a place like this! It's been so long, Mr. Kiryu. Uh, yeah. Uh, been a while, Shizuko. Uh, all this time you still remember, huh? As if I could ever forget? As far as I'm concerned, you saved my life. Your life? It's true. I've been wanting to see you again, Kiryu-san. Kiryu-san, this is such a nice surprise. Really, I'm so glad. Yeah, me too. You were just a kid last time I saw you. Sure enough, you became a young lady. No, not even close. I'm still just a high schooler. So back then, I take it the surgery went well? Yes, sir. The doctor did everything just right, and rehabilitation went well too. Now I'm better than ever. I got my life back, and I have you to thank for it. But I didn't do anything. No, you really did. I was terrified of surgery, but then you brought Michio-kun to see me. Thanks to Michio-kun, I finally had the courage. Without that, well, I might never have... <sighs> Things might have gone different. Truly, you and Michio-kun changed my life. I've wanted to say thanks ever since. For all you did. Trouble was, I had only met you once, and never learned anything else about you. It's been my one big regret. I'm so happy I got this chance, more than I can say. Yeah. Honestly, I'd often worry about your surgery. Thanks to today, I don't have to. <laughs> well, I never guessed you lived in Tokyo. <laughs> no wonder I couldn't find you in Onomichi. That reminds me, why are you in Kamurocho? Did you move away recently? I did. Actually, I'm studying to become a doctor. Just recently, I got accepted into a special school. So with that, my family moved out here. A doctor? <laughs> That's wonderful. If I become one, that is. My classmates are so smart. I have a hard time keeping up. Still, it's my hope I'll save someone's life someday. I'll help them, just like my doctor helped me. So with that, I'll keep on studying. I'm gonna make this dream of mine come true. You've really grown up, Shizuko. And it's a great dream. Keep going, and I'm sure you'll get there. Right! And hey, if you ever get sick, look me up. I'll help you get better. <laughs> you never know. Hey, thanks. If that happens, I'll know who to call. <laughs> okay! Uh, well, should we get going? If I recall, you've got somewhere to be, right? I'll walk you. People aren't too friendly around here. Okay. Thank you so much. For the future. 
Try not to come here alone again, okay? Yes, sir. I got lost, is all. I'll remember not to walk around Komorocho by myself. Your keychain. It's Onomichio. Guess you're still a fan, huh? <laughs> of course! It's like I always say, I'm gonna marry him someday. Yeah, I remember you said that even way back. So it's become a doctor and marry Michio, huh? <laughs> Personally, I think you can find someone better. Huh? But why? Michio-kun's so funny and gentle and strong. <laughs> what more could you want in a husband? Nah. Truth be told, he's a handful. He's also stubborn, clumsy, and awkward to a fault. Um... Hear you, son? Hmm? This may be kind of forward, but... Uh, the man in the Michio-kun costume back then... Was that...? There you are. Been looking for you, old man. Thought I'd pay back what I owe you. Figure with my buds here, I'll add a little interest. Hear you, son? Just hang back, Shizuko. You're safe with me. But wait, if you get hurt... If it means protecting you, a couple scratches is more than worth it. Hey, now, what's this? You gonna run for it, huh? You're gonna wish I had. But sorry, no. I'd never embarrass myself in front of a kid. I'm not holding back. If you've got a death wish, take your best shot! Let's do this! Let's do it. I'll follow your lead. Let's Are you done with all the fun and games yet? <laughs> Follow my lead. Just this one night. Who wants to go? Nothing personal. Nothing. Are you okay, Shizuko? Thanks to you, Kiryu-san, you saved me, like you did last time. Great. Anyway, let's go. Y y y yes, sir. Thanks so much for everything today. You even showed me around. <laughs> Nonsense. Happy to do so. Please, I want you to have this. My way of saying thanks. Use it, wear it, whatever you like. <laughs> and look, Kiryu-san, we even match. You sure I can have this? It's pretty special to you, isn't it? Oh, no worries. I have like 50 of those at home, so it's fine. Kind of excessive, don't you think? <laughs> but thanks. I want you to know I have nothing but gratitude for you, Kiryu-san. Look at me, I'm no good. I might be older now, but I'd probably be dead without you. I just keep taking and never give back. Kiryu-san, forgive me. I wish there was more I could do for you. 
She's a girl. You've done enough. Huh? I said you've done enough. In fact, today I got more than I could have ever asked for. The little girl I once knew, she shivered at the thought of surgery. Now here she is, all grown up, chasing her dream, and making every day count. Might come as a surprise, but do you know how much courage you've given me? Kiryu san. Trust me, you're gonna be a great doctor. As long as you don't give up, I know you'll make it happen. So keep at it. Do your best. Eventually, when you see people suffering like you once did, you'll know how to help. And remember this. I'll always be rooting for you. And you're a special friend, Michio-kun? I'm sure he feels the same way. <laughs> so long, Shizuko. Take care of yourself. Son. Hmm? Well, I just... Thank you, Somichi. <laughs> Back at you. Thank you, Somichi. Thank you, Kiryu-san. No. Michio-kun. it's being renovated not surprising this town's always had a high turnover rate oh for shine same name as that club I helped out in Sotombori way back when I nearly went under because of a rival club at least until I stepped in as their manager <laughs> it was tough work but still a great experience I haven't seen Yuki, Koyuki, and Yoda-san since then. Hope they're doing well. But if this joint's got the same name... Hmm. Did they open up a new location? Um, excuse me. Did you need something? <laughs> Not good. Wait, have we met before? N no, I think you've got the wrong guy. Uh, take care. Hmm? 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 Uh, do you need something? Oh, my gosh! It's Kiryu-san! You just vanished into thin air one day! I thought you kicked the bucket somewhere! You really ought to show your face more often! But wow, it's so good to see you! How's it going? Uh, it's been going. What about you, Koyuki? You doing okay? Is this the same Forshine? Sure is! Forshine, the hottest cabaret club in Osaka, is coming to Kanto! In fact, we're gonna have our grand opening soon! Oh yeah? That's great. So how's business? Doing well? Well, no. Not really. Yo, you Kansai clowns still haven't hit the road yet? Look, you people are the problem here. Outsiders can't just waltz on in and pop up a club whenever, wherever they want. That's not how we roll in Kamarocho. You hear me? You old hags got no place here. How many times we gotta tell you that, Koyuki-san? Uh, 
Here we go again. Hmm? Who's he? Some guy from one of the rival clubs. He doesn't like that we set up shop here, so he's been harassing us. Thanks to him, there are some nasty rumors going around. And to make matters worse, a few of our girls got scared off and quit. Ugh, that man's nothing but trouble. Come on now, we just want to settle things peacefully. But if you insist on running a club here, we're gonna have to insist you comply with our ways, all right? And this conversation's over. Honestly, I'd rather die than take orders from you. Rude bitch. Find them. I'll just have to beat them into you myself. And how are you gonna do that? Who the hell are you? One of their hires, as far as I know. Kamurocha doesn't roll any which way. You've got no right to mouth off about how things work around here. Right back at you, old man. Whatever. Guess I'll have to beat your ass first. I'm gonna send all of you packing. You'll wish you never set foot in my city. Bring it on. Let's do it. I am done with all the fun games. Follow my lead. Here, all about me. No. You want some? Try and stop me. I'll take Found them. I got something wrong. It's my turn. I won't hold back. We doing this. <laughs> How's this guy eating? He's way too strong. Now beat it. Come back here, and you deal with me. You won't catch me here again! I'm so sorry about that. You helped me out of a tough spot there. The same as ever. <laughs> right, Kiryu-san? No, not necessarily. Anyway, before we were so rudely interrupted, I was just about to ask you to come on in for some tea. Step this way, please. Right behind you. Real spacious here. Not bad. <laughs> we pretty much took over the previous club. It's a great spot and all, so we went ahead and rented it out. So, what happened to Forshine after I left? Well, after you made Forshine the number one club in Sotenbori, Yuki-san, Yoda-san, and I worked as a team to keep it that way. And for 15 years, we were the best of the best in all of Kansai. Impressive, right? <laughs> sure is. Much harder to stay up top than to get there. Then, why are you here in Kamurocho, now of all times? Actually, I discussed branching out with Yuki-san and Yoda-san, but you know them. Not a greedy bone in their bodies. They didn't want to risk the club's quality dropping either. But after they retired, I was the one who ended up in charge. I figured, since I'm taking their place and all, maybe I ought to try something new, you know? I see. So Koyuki, the new owner on the block, wanted to give the Kanto expansion a shot. Well, it didn't have to be Kanto, honestly. I just really love Four Shine, and I want to share it with people outside of Kansai, too. The girls back in Sotenbori are golden. They don't need me there to run the club. That's why I thought I should challenge myself. Do something only the owner could do. That's great. I'm not surprised you went for it, given how much you cherish the place. Thank you. <laughs> Still, I never knew how tough it is to run a business. It's so different from serving the customers. There are way too many factors to take into account and no end to trouble, like that guy from earlier. To think Yuki-san and Yoda-san have been doing this for years. Huh. I can't help but respect them even more. 
It was one heck of a wake-up call. I had no idea so many people were looking out for us hostesses in ways we never even knew. Well, now that you realize that, I'm sure you'll do just fine. Sorry for dropping in at such a busy time. Oh no, you're perfectly fine. To be honest, I wish you'd stay. Having you as the manager would be a huge weight off my shoulders. Hey now, you're gonna put me to work again? <laughs> Give me a break. <laughs> Just kidding. I'm serious about being short-staffed, though. We've lost a few of our girls to some threats, and some of our staff have even been headhunted. <sighs> it's gotten me kinda down recently. I guess some things never change, no matter the times. But why not ask the Sotombori Club for help? I mean, I could, but the girls there are really popular. And since we'll be opening soon, I doubt I could adjust everyone's schedule in time. Hmm. Then why don't you ask Yuki for help? She used to be the legendary hostess, didn't she? Yeah, she'd really turn things around. <laughs> if I could even bring myself to ask. What's happening with Yuki? Yuki-san's out there making her own dreams come true and trying something new. And what's that? Running a restaurant. She used the money she saved up from her hostess days to start it up. <sighs> Told me herself that she's been super busy since it took off. I just felt like I couldn't bother her with my problems. <laughs> Not when she's got enough on her plate. And I'd feel real bad disturbing her if she's on track to success. <sighs> Wouldn't want to drag her down or anything. That, and uh, I can't keep crawling to Yuki-san for help. I need to handle this on my own. Ow! 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 What's wrong? Oh, nothing. It's just because I've been buried in work, my stomach's not feeling too great. Don't push yourself too hard, all right? So, Yuki's got a new place, huh? What kind of restaurant is it? She hasn't told me much about it. All I know is that she set up shop in Yokohama in a corner of a building that's got a lot of bars. Sounds like Eugene Cho. It probably is. Given the location and how she was the legendary hostess, I'm sure she's running a bar or something. I wish I could swing by, but since this is a new venture for her, I'd feel like I'd be a bother if I showed up. Well, I'm actually staying in Eugene Cho right now. Wow, small world. You should drop in and say hi then. That'd totally make Yuki-san's whole day. I mean it, go. Hmm? Uh, all right. Cool, let me know how it is. And if she's worried about the club, just tell her everything's going fine and to focus on her place. Got it, I'll uh, pass on the message. Thanks so much. And I hope you can stop by for our grand opening, Kiryu-san. Five the time, I will. I know things are tough right now, but don't overdo it. That's always been a bad habit of yours. Right, I'll keep that in mind. But still, I'm really happy I got to see you again. And I'm real proud of how much you've grown, Koyuki. I'll catch you later. All right. 